So Chicago, they have all these like carousel doors that I'm not used to. Here we go. Going to the Apple store. I'm running a little late. The number one reason why I'm late is Starbucks. Thank you. Thank you. Happy New Year. You too. Happy New Year. But thank you. Bye. Back to a turnstile again. This one's automatic, so it's really weird. I keep getting stuck. Okay, I'm out. We're gonna be late to the Apple store. So I hear if you're getting your battery replaced, they keep your phone for four days. Uh, that's not gonna happen because I'm only in Chicago till tomorrow. I'm so excited finally to be able to have my iPhone charged all day, not having it die like two or three times a day and never having a phone when I need it. So I'm in line, it's gonna take like 15 minutes. I thought I needed a new battery, but evidently I didn't. My battery's good, which is good news. But then why does my phone keep dying? I don't know. I guess I use it too much. <laughs> Starbucks. It helps the cold <laughs> so much better when you have a hot coffee. So cold, come on. So 2017 is over and now it is 2018 and I'm so excited. I started Nurse Blake back in May 2017. I got a new studio in my studio apartment in Seattle, Washington, and I'm really excited to start filming there and posting videos to YouTube and Facebook. And I'm also excited to blog. I got all new camera equipment, so I will be taking on all my adventures on a weekly basis, whether that be me traveling, uh, me going to conferences and conventions, or just working in the studio at home. I believe that if we all um, I guess shared our experiences together, we'd be able to learn so much from one another and help grow professionally and also help grow the nursing profession as a whole. It's been a fun year. 2017 was amazing. Again, I learned so much, but I am even more excited for what 2018 is going to bring. But thank you guys so much for watching my videos, liking and sharing my content, and I will see you back in Seattle. But first, let's go explore the city. So I just saw the coolest thing walking through the terminal. There's actually a nurse giving out flu shots, which is perfect because it's flu season. And when you're at the airport, you're typically, if you get here early, you're just waiting around for your plane. So I thought it was really cool that they were offering flu shots. I'm not sure which hospital or clinic she was with, but what she did say is they actually have a clinic, like a full like clinic in one of the terminals. So if you need to see a practitioner about something that you could see one here at the airport while you're waiting. I just thought it was really cool. And I'm sure more airports will probably do that in the future if it's a success. But it was awesome that they were giving out flu shots to those who need it. I already got mine in the season earlier, but if I didn't get mine, it would be perfect because I'm here at the airport like two hours early. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Probably go to Starbucks or something. Or look at the neck pillows because I love a good airplane neck pillow. 